Hello and welcome to Wall Street Training's complex, super advanced merger modeling course. Wall Street Training provides financial modeling, valuation modeling, mergers and acquisitions, merger and leverage buyout modeling training to corporations, as well as through public open enrollment seminars and self-study video-based learning. My name is Hamilton Lin, president and founder of Wall Street Training, and I will be instructor throughout this course. My background is primarily in investment banking, mergers and acquisitions, having worked at Goldman Sachs' Investment Bank and Research, Bank of America Securities' Mergers and Acquisitions Group, as well as several other boutique investment banks, again, all focused on mergers and acquisitions. I'm a CFA charter holder as well as a CFA instructor. The goal of this particular complex merger modeling course is to build a full combination and merger analysis of two companies, Target and Acquire, integrating the full projection model for both. This will allow you to build one of the most dynamic and sophisticated and complex merger models out there, slapping together the income statement, the balance sheet, and the cash flow statement for both companies, as well as creating a brand new merged full projection model as well. We will determine the deal structure, purchase price allocation, tax deductibility, accretion dilution, and countless other issues. We will, again, be extremely keyboard and shortcut oriented to speed up your number crunching so you can spend more time qualitatively to properly analyze and interpret your quantitative results. Again, before you get started, please take the time to first change your background to gray, which it should be by now already by the time you got to this point, and also to install our Wall Street Training add-in macro files. This course assumes you have a detailed, an absolute detailed understanding of accounting, knowledge of Excel, and fundamental concepts in finance and valuation. Prerequisites for this course, again, accounting and financial statement integration, our company profiles, corporate valuation methodologies, our basic and advanced financial modeling courses, as well as our basic merger modeling course, our M&A deal structuring, and definitely, definitely the complex LBO model. That will be the company that will be acquired, JCPenney, and we will build and take that completed core LBO model, not the enhancements, but the core LBO model, and we'll slap that into this uh, merger model. So you have to make sure that in a short little while, you have that core model ready, that LBO model, which you would have only been able to access when you completed our complex leverage buyout modeling course. And of course, please have a hard copy of the Target 10K filing Target, as in Target, who is actually going to be our choir. So we got a little name problem here. Now, the way we're uh, going to uh, run this course is first, we'll create a brand new acquirer standalone projection model, similar to what we did in the advanced financial model and the core model, as well as the first part of building a standalone projection model for that JCPenney, who is going to be our Target company being acquired. Now, the company that will acquire JCPenney to Target is actually called Target, Target, if you will, and they will be acquiring JCPenney. So first thing we will do is build that standalone projection model for the acquirer, Target. So from now on, whenever I say Target, that means JCPenney. Whenever I say Target, that means the acquirer, the company acquiring JCPenney, the Target company. Uh, once we've finished completing, uh, finished completing the uh, Target standalone projection model, We'll head to our merger model template. We will uh, calculate, similar to LBO, we'll calculate our merger summary, our sources and uses, which again is going to be one of the most important drivers and inputs that control the entire larger merger model. Same thing as before in the LBO. We'll calculate our valuation parameters, our deal structure, our post-transaction ownership, purchase price allocation, step up to fair market value, etc. We will have all of these flow through the income statement, the balance sheet, the cash flow. Again, combine the two companies together, calculate our pro forma, after transaction values, as well as the projected figures. We will significantly alter and expand the debt sweep. We're going to do a debt sweep on steroids to incorporate the new tranches and layers of debt and create new decision rules on repayments as well as uh, prepayments and whatnot. Well, why don't we just get right to it? You should have up on your screen right now the target, rather the target, the acquirer, target model template which would be the first thing we will do, and let's very quickly now, this would be at least the third or fourth time you, you're gonna have to build me a full standalone projection model, so we'll be able to go through this very quickly, have the 10K filing for Target, the acquirer, out handy, and let's go ahead and start building the model. 